Like accepting these friend requests. Uh, I don't know why I get so many. Hmm. These could be from really suspicious people, but you know what? I don't judge. I'm friends with everyone. Actually, Casey, I think the person who donated to the Patreon was like a fake person. That's just gonna like, un like, redact their payment at the last second. Cause I looked up their account and it looks like it was banned and the email is fake too. So, <laughs> darn it. We didn't actually reach a new goal. People want to troll the Puyo community. Thanks a lot, world. Uh, actually, I should make this private, huh? Let's do minimum chain 2. Huh, Seth? Do you even have the Switch version? No, I feel like I should be grinding my rank more, but I super really don't care. <laughs> like, it's too hard. Too many Tetris players. And like I haven't had time to wake up at like 6am in the morning to play against the Puyo players from Japan. Oh, so I kinda just don't do it. Maybe this Friday? 
No, no, I just don't have time because I have to go to work in the morning. Oh, the Puyo, ne the Puyo official Twitter says, How is the competition out there in Puyo Puyo Tetris able to move up in the ranks? Hmm. No. Because everyone just plays Tetris. And um, Puyo is at a slight disadvantage. So. Hmm. Sigh. Well, I'll retweet this tweet because I have to. <laughs> okay, everyone's here. If you notice, I put the form I attend to practice in the bottom right corner of the screen. So hopefully I can pull it off. I'll actually, wait one second. You challenging me? Is it our turn? Let's get to work! Chains longer than that. Well, I guess I made that for the opener decently. Yeah, maybe I should set the chain minimum to higher. Okay, this distribution doesn't allow me to make. Guys, you have to go for 10 chains! Come on! <laughs> Guys! Wow. I guess I have to account for the fact that everyone just wants to win, huh? So they're practicing new forms? I like that kind of fighting spirit, but uh, not today, guys. <laughs> Completely wrong, huh? guys gotta go for like a ten chain come on <laughs> oh 
Alright, maybe we just have to finish this. That's okay, I'll just remake the room on the next turn, the next round. Nice power at the end. Too much whack. I mean, you need to at least shoot for like a six or a seven. Okay, let me remake the room. Try your hardest, okay? Let's go for big chains. Let's get to work. Looks like it's my turn. Hey Geodyne, thanks. Let's do this. Hope I can show you some nice chaining. But I'm kinda experimenting with things I don't really know how to do today, so it could end horribly. As usual. Huh? Oh, hmm. That was kind of ugly. Wow, I don't really like that. I made this work, but I don't really like it. It's so dirty and bulky, not clean. I know I could change better than this. Whoa! 
<laughs> so wait, you three, what forms are you trying to go for? Using these puyos efficiently, uh huh? What should I do? Whoa! Hey! Huh? Yeah. Awesome. Swing in! Awesome! Huh? Awesome! Whoa! Move. Hey! Speed up! Feel the rush! Hmm. I don't know how to chain at all. I think tailing on top of the Yaoi is what's getting to me. I mean, doing the base correctly, first of all, is already kind of a challenge. Should I even go for it in this distribution? I don't know. This wasn't good at all. Huh? But I have the experiment with chains I'm that? not familiar with if I want to get better. Awesome. Huh? How's that? Cyan. Whoa! Awesome. Better. Speed up. Feel the rush. Hard drop. Wait, those blues don't tail off the bottle. Wow, that was bad. Gotta get better at that. I don't know why I thought that blues would work on the tail. I guess I was just tunnel too tunnel vision on figuring out how they make how to make the Yaoi work. Um Okay, first three pieces. Is this possible with this? Whoa! 
Aw, oh, this tail? Pretty complicated. I didn't do it so well. to see this go off. That was decent. The minimum chain is set, set to a 7. Wow, so how GTR was better to do in this situation. Hmm. Somehow it became GTR instead. I wonder how. I don't like how I chose the greens for column 3. What a silly idea. I tried to do Kenny style for the tail, but that didn't work either. I'm so bad. <laughs> Why? Shoulder's chain. He's still pretty high. Oh, what is he shooting for, actually? That's so confusing. Uh, just a 12. Hey, Oz, what's up? Rotate over! Is this correct?
Hello, little hedgehog. What's up? If it doesn't end in an all clear, are you sure you can really call it a chain? Hmm, I don't know. Okay, there's too many colors with these starting pieces, so I don't think I can go for Yaoi easily. Maybe I should go for... Oh, uh, this wasn't good at all. I didn't do this L shape in the right order. I wonder if I can salvage it somehow. Purples in column two. Hmm, who disconnected? Well, I guess the room's opening up for different people if you want to snipe it. Wow, is this stuck? Hey guys, look, I got six times my follower goal. Isn't that really amazing? I did well today. keep my expectations low, just in case I don't do well one day. I will always be proud of myself. Oh, thanks for following, Naglfar. NR? What does the NR stand for? No righteousness? No right, no wrong? Also, where is everyone else? Shouldn't you guys be joining this room? Where are you guys? It's just this person here. Or... Kyle Kyle. Hey, that's actually a really cool name. I think Kyle is such a cool word. The first time I heard it was when I was taking organic chemistry in my uh, freshman year of college. We talked about the chirality of uh, certain molecules. Especially uh, tetrahedral ones. Oh, so many followers! Uh, my goal can't keep up! Wow! Ah. Is anyone allowed to join? Yeah, anyone's allowed to join. Oh, guys! 
14 times my follower goal. Holy crap. Uh, I'm the first Twitch streamer to pronounce your name right. Huh? I think Carl is just such a cool word. Of course I'll pronounce it right. Probably. Oh, Shiro! Hey! <laughs> what games did I play before Puyo Puyo Tetris? Uh huh. I guess I played Puyo Puyo 20th Anniversary and Puyo Puyo Chronicle and uh, Puyo Versus. You can't fight destiny. Time to set the bar higher. Well, like I said, it's better to keep your expectations low so you're never disappointed. Beautiful. I can see it. So ugly. I don't like this chain. I want to give up. Huh? I can see it. It's coming. I can see it. I can see it. I can see it. This isn't set up for a second floor very well. I think I made the tail too high. It's coming. Uh, that's up. No, I didn't use my column six space very well. Mine was also a 12 chain. I think that's just the effect of everyone else dying. I think that increased the damage multiplier. <laughs> wow. I can see 
No, I was almost done. I think I had like 16 going there. Maybe? Oh, it's because, Little Hedgehog, it's because I'm streaming to Twitch and YouTube at the same time. Yeah, I use Restream.io. It's really nice. Thunder says, I was in the stream earlier stream, but didn't have any courage to say anything. But you find my skills amazing. Thanks! You consider picking up Puyo Puyo Tetris for pretty much no reason, you suck at it. Huh? I mean, all it takes is practice. I mean, if you've watched our previous streams, you know that I can play a lot faster and chain better. But, I mean, just like everyone else, I have to struggle with new things too. I think this will work out the way I intended to. Probably. Wait, no, I cut my greens at the end. Mm, I wasn't careful enough. I mean, that's still super strong. But it could have been a 15. You haven't gone online at all. Because of know you lose like this. Kind of bummed that the base game doesn't have fever mode in it normally. Uh, I don't know why they didn't include that. I feel like it wouldn't have been that hard. But you know, who knows what Sega is thinking half the time. <laughs> I've come to realize that she just... I question Sonic Team so hard. They do their thing. Uh, yeah. Actually, I actually have no follow-up to that. <laughs> they just do whatever. Oh 
Be the second transition, kind of like the. I don't know how that was more powerful, it shouldn't have been. <laughs> That's the way Puyo Ted just calculates damage when people die. Two weeks until you get Switch and Puyo Puyo Tetris. Alright Kyle, once you get it, let's play. I'll be waiting for you. Probably. like how this is about to turn out. I did the reds wrong. It's coming. That's not good. I can see it. It's coming. How do I make this transition easier on me? I should redo it. It's coming. A waste of pleos like this becomes a lot easier. I'm such an idiot! I really don't feel like working on this chain anymore. It killed my motivation. I can see it. It's coming. I can see it. I can see it. It's coming. Oh, I'm really tired. Mike Boot says, hey, how long have I been playing Puyo Puyo? You just got Puyo Tetris and you can't believe the skills I'm showcasing here. Um, I've been playing for about 10 years, but most of those 10 years are filled with loneliness and no one to play with, so I didn't improve very fast. But, you know, hard work does pay off eventually, so this is where I'm at now. Uh, Furami says, you find Puyo matches fascinating. Being able to keep up with your chain and not disrupting it is something you want to achieve someday. Yeah, I think you can do it. Just image train how the pro players play and eventually you'll get it. Nagafar says, 
Arm it asks, would it be a good idea to branch out and learn a whole bunch of forms right away? Um, I mean, I feel like that's kind of the trick to Puyo. Like, you might think like focusing on stairs and single arch one at a time is the way to go. But actually, I feel like you do learn a lot quicker if you're brave enough to just, you know, just give it a shot to try everything at once. Sometimes it helps too. I'm not sure. Guess this is fine. Not as clean as I wanted it to be. so bad gosh oh gosh oh no wait i can't rotate that over darn it two weeks in you have a vague grasp on stairs same to gtr you can to get a lot better at those but you're wondering would it be better just to have more options too I mean, I think the number one thing is just practicing anything at all, so... Your shirt... Puyo Puyo isn't like other games where you have like balance patches that totally nerf certain forms or others. You can stay confident that whatever you learn, try to practice, will stay relevant forever. So don't be afraid just to try anything you feel like. As long as you stay motivated and interested, I think that's what's most important. So if you find doing a ton of different forms more fun for you, then just do that. Oh, I'm really bad at reading stream chat. <laughs> yeah, this is with viewers, Flameburger. <laughs> um... I'm playing on Puyo Tetris because the RNG is kind of different from Puyo Versus. I mean, not so different that it's like a totally different game. But it's something that I just want to make sure I'm used to if I ever have to go to a, tor a tournament. There are local tournaments here in Georgia that I help out with. There's also going to be a tournament at Momocon this year too. So I want to be ready for that. Oh, and uh, I don't know, keep this on the down low, I guess. I think I recently got invited to attend um, another convention in June called the Southern Fried Gaming Expo. The Southern Fried Game Room Expo. It's mainly for like pinball and stuff, but they do retro games too. And I brought Puyo Tetris last year just to exhibit it, and lots of families loved it. So they asked me if I could come back and show off the game again, especially now that it's in English. So I'm gonna go there this year too. I wanna show people what Puyo is like. Fire people fire up people's spirits for tournaments. Get everyone excited to fight! Hey Oz, what's up? Nick Smart says, I'm planning to join this, but there's one problem. The highest chain I ever got was a 6. Kinda suck at Puyo Puyo. Uh... I mean... You gotta push past your limits. That's all you gotta do. 
believe in yourself, you can get past the six. Here I come! Let's play together! I mean, if I can do it, you can do it too. Cue the music! I mean, it took me years and years to get to where I am. But now, you have all sorts of different friends and family available in the Puyo community to help you out and teach you how to chain. I didn't have that I didn't have that kind of support when I was starting this game. So I mean you're really lucky. I think you can improve fast no if you really believe in it. yourself. And just uh chat with the other players. I'll just set this off. I think this chain is decent. I want to see how it goes. Nice. I think I'm getting the hang of the build orders. Is there a rundown of how the Puyo Puyo randomizer works? Um. I know the Puyo Puyo 2 arcade RG was um, reverse engineered, but for the modern games, we don't know yet. I mean, there isn't much interest in reverse engineering it, mainly because, I mean, it's pretty simple, you know? And knowing more about it doesn't drastically change your chaining logic, either. You just get a distribution of four colors, so... That's what I think, at least. Finally, it looked like the chain simulator. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm not good at Yaoi. Do I have any thoughts on fusion mode? It's the best mode in this game. I love it. I love fusion mode. Fusion mode is the greatest. Fusion mode only. Finaru Destination New. Uh, chain Limit 7. Science Bear. Those are all experimenting, right?
Let's do the this. music. Here we are. Goo goo. I don't intend to lose. Cue the music. Hmm. Party mode in Tetris versus slot mode in 20th. Yo, are you trying to like give me make some bad memories for me like resurface? I don't want to talk about it. Let's not talk about party mode. Party mode is banned from this chat room from this moment on. Or slot mode, I mean. Never talk about slots again around me. I'll like I'll destroy you. Is slot mode. I can't believe Sega did something so evil. Like, what the heck? There's something I wanted to do with this like transition, but I just didn't do it right. I think I'll just settle for this, huh? Uh, no, that's not how it works. Oh darn it! I set it off. I'm so sorry, guys. Pento Amino item, yeah, that's pretty much the worst thing you can get in party mode if you're playing Tetris. Everything else is not so bad. Whereas in Puyo, there's like so many different things I could screw you over. Like, a lot of different things. I'm not getting any greens. This kind of really sucks. Oh no, I messed up! <laughs> Can you tease me in Pentaminos? I don't think so. I don't really know. The Pentaminos have really screwy rotation rules. I don't really understand it myself. Party mode drove you nuts in adventure mode. So many times you'll be right next to the two star goal and you'll get hit by a score vacuum. Uh, I mean, my strategy for party mode and story mode is uh, you just get such a huge, overwhelming lead that it doesn't really matter what happens to you. But I guess you just have to be really good at the game first. I don't think that advice really helps you.
Let's... I think I have an interesting power at the end. I'm gonna see it go off. Wait, no, that doesn't work, huh? I'm such an idiot. Well. Does the Tetris Wiki even have documentation for a pentamino rotation? I don't really know actually. I don't think so. I don't even think it's a smart idea to go for Yaoi in this situation. Oh, this distribution I think. Did it anyways? Not too bad, I guess. Pronouncing that greatly. No, I'm not. But it's an interesting verse to touch his clones with Pentaminos mixed in. And lines with orbs you can do use to do special moves and junk. Yeah, that, that was supposed to be like a clone of Tetris Battle Gaiden, right? I always thought Tetris Battle Gaiden was pretty interesting. But I don't know. I know the fact that special moves get people really hyped about like, I don't know, character matchups and stuff. But I feel like in a puzzle game, symmetry is more valuable. Symmetry between like your character, like character, like the RNG and the character effects or whatever. I mean, basically, I'm saying I appreciate Puyo. <laughs> if you couldn't tell my bias. Something decent set up, so I'm satisfied with that, I guess. Oh, fish cakes. We did it, Carmi. Oh. 
I don't really like how this is taking me so much effort just to get it clean. This is not optimal. I feel like just quitting and trying again. No, I didn't do this right. Uh, you know, no, it's so bad. They didn't know what I was doing. Wait, do these yellows cut the yellows at the bottom? I kinda hope not. Oh, I think they do. Darn it! My tail! We took so long that the margin time increased a lot. right. How do I make it better? I set it off. No, the tail. Oops. Uh, it wasn't as clean as I wanted it to be. Oh, my God. 
I'm making my chain yet. Uh, I don't know if it's fix those yellows. There's a lot I need to fix. This wasn't very efficient at all. You know, people who bought this game purely wanting a Tetris game and trying to avoid all the Puyo they could. Yeah, unfortunately, there's people like that in this world. But. You know, what can you do? It's their right as a consumer to do whatever they want. But if there's one thing we can do, it's... To show people lots of high level play. Get them interested in the characters and lore or just anything else. Make them appreciate Puyo for what it is. And that's how we'll get people to... Uh, play Puyo. Forever and ever and ever. Happily ever after. Really complicated chain, but Shiro got his chain done first. You're in a financial pitch, but you plan to get it on PS4. Most of your experience with Puyo was Kirby's Avalanche and Mean Bee Machine. Hey. Yeah, so those are pretty old versions of Puyo Puyo, and there has been a mechanics change since then. So, in the newer Puyo games, you can counter attacks by setting off a chain at the same time. So that changes the metagame completely. Like, you actually have to be able to, uh, you know, read your opponent and send harassment chains at them at the right time. Like, the addition of the uh, the offset rule, it really, it compels, it compelled players to actually get good at chaining. And you know, if both players are good at chaining, then the only way to ensure you get have an advantage is to make sure you seal your opponent with harassment. But that's what makes Puyo very interesting to me. I remember to read your opponent and stuff. I don't think there's any other puzzle game that puts that much emphasis and has the same simplicity and design as Puyo Puyo. Gunder says, I had never heard of Puyo until this game, so I got it without even considering looking into it, but it's really cool. Great! I like that you think that way. I hope I can keep showing you that Puyo is a great game. 
Um, how do I do this one? This? Hey, I got it just like the chainsaw. Something I wanted to do. Oh, I think I kind of lost track. <laughs> oh no! Step it up. Yes. Uh -huh. time. Eh? Is that the full chain? Oh, no, it's not. Cool. I'll live to see another day. These colors are too like complicated. The way I ordered it, it's not good. Like, where is my greens? And I think no, if I pop it how it is, purples conflict. Ah uh, no, I hate myself. Have you ever felt like you just never did anything right in your life? Watch a few hours of Puyo Puyo's song. <laughs> Well, Puyo Puyo sounds a really old game. I'm not sure how you'll get it either. Probably from an import site.
Yeah, I committed to this form, but I'm not sure how to extend it. Yeah, I didn't do this really well. I was thinking there was a possible way to do that, but I wasn't getting the pieces coming. You like Puyo a lot, but the chaining hasn't clicked for me yet. You can't see them like a can in Panel to Pawn. Uh, yeah. I guess there's just, just a lot more different branching paths you can do for Puyo chains. They make it much harder to uh, visualize. How was I gonna do this again? Mm. Uh, I'm getting kind of tired already. Mm. I've only been streaming for like an hour. I'm just gonna do whatever. Too tired to think about this right now. I have to have blue in column 4, that's for sure. It wasn't smart how I locked myself into that. Oh. What's the highest chain I've ever gotten? I don't know, like a 15? Most of the people I know, you know, that know Tetris consider the whole feature to be a sin that goes against the goods of the universe. Well, I wouldn't say that about the whole feature. I mean... So the thing about like not having a hold feature is that eventually... I think having a hold feature is what makes it actually possible to play forever. But otherwise, eventually, without a hold feature, you eventually get screwed over by the RNG. Especially if you don't have like 5 previews. Well, I guess TGM doesn't have a hold feature in some of the games. But those aren't made in consideration of going infinitely long, so... Can I play Puyo solo? Yeah, you can, but I like playing with other people. Also, I hate my chain this round. I don't care. I'll just restream chat. Not a perfect clear. What's a perfect clear? In Puyo, we have all clears, Casey. Dr. Mario feels too similar to Puyo for this crossover. Uh, Bejeweled or Columns? <laughs> Bejeweled. Really? Mm, I don't know. Yeah, if you don't really have money, I'd suggest play, playing Puyo Versus. That's a good substitute. I'm not saying that you should not buy Puyo Tetris. You should get it eventually. Because it's good to have an official Puyo game to practice on for like conventions and stuff. But... They have no options! They're like super duper duper poor. But you still want to become a professional Puyo player one day. Puyo versus? Sure. I don't know. 
How was it doing with us? Chain's all right. Just all right. Where is my green? For real. Will this cut somewhere? I don't even know. I'm getting confused. <laughs> no, my yellows! I needed those yellows in column 2. Aw, man. That wasn't nice. Dazzle says, I'm gonna go ahead and join the Discord. Probably won't be talking much, but no harm in lurking. Hey, that's fine. Uh, I mean, if you join the Discord, you'll keep up with any Puyo news there. So that's nice. Hey, multiplayer, would it not be better to smash things quicker to mess with your opponent? Yeah, but today we're not, look we're not aiming for that. It's not a super serious match. We're just here to practice some changing forms. Let's get our foundation strong first. Harassment something that comes a little bit later. Sad music for not really sad events. I don't know what how I'm expecting this green to ever work. It's not. I guess I'll just have to. No, this doesn't work either, huh? I feel like this cut somewhere. Very annoyingly. My blues. They need to do more research into the Japanese website of how they consider the utility of Yayoi. Huh? 
You know what? I don't think this is... Huh? Yeah, this is a much clearer solution here. Sometimes he shouldn't always try to force his uh, chaining form. Sorry if like my sleepiness makes any of you guys sleepy. <laughs> like, whoops. Turns out I don't get lots of sleep every night because I'm too busy trying to figure out how to grow the community. How about how about this chain? Um, who follows? Er, 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 yeah. Thanks for the follow. Uh, you too, Cap and Dumbrion. Uh, thanks, everyone. If you're ha ha harassing mindlessly, you run the risk of the other player countering your harassment and sending a lethal amount of garbage since your chain won't be as big. Yeah, that is a very important consideration. You have to gauge the risk of every attack you do. It's kind of like poker, I guess. The Tetris people you know are people who played the NES and hate change. Mm, yeah, there's a lot of people in this world who hate change. But you know what? I hate them. They don't play Puyo. We can never be friends. a little too slow. Tetris DX you can wall climb so you can literally drive up walls. That's funny. I didn't know that. My body says GCR, but my mind says no. Oh, I don't know what to think right now. I'm so tired. Here, let me just drop this round. I just kind of went to read chat. How's that? You have a problem with Game Boy Tetris, but you mean it's kind of supposed to be that way, so you lose. Yeah. Oh, wow! This stream chat has so many. Chatters. You like how on the Puyo Nexus wiki, Suketo Dara is specifically described as having sexy arms and legs. <laughs> yeah, he's beautiful. Oh, level 97 Snowbird. Yeah, if you want to hop in sometimes, then you should. Actually, maybe I should remake the room so different people can join in. I think I'll do it after this round. <laughs> Vice Arcadia donated $50. What? Fighting Shazlo by Moonlight, winning Arl's love by daylight, never running from a Puyo fight. He is the one named Sailor Satan. Yeah, thank you so much. Wow. <laughs> ow, ow. Thank you. Wow. Wow, getting a donation is always pretty nice. Thank you. I'm gonna use a straight to supporting the um 
So you know how we're doing, how Puyo Nexus is doing a fan panel oh, for Momocon, right? We're, I'm gonna buy some prizes for that using your money, if you're okay with that. Oh man, no! Oh, yeah, I was like almost about to swallow some water. <laughs> oh, fish cakes. We did it, Carby. Goo -goo. You could buy people prizes, or I could cosplay as Amity. Hmm. Well, I do have a dinosaur costume. Maybe I'll just wear that to Momocon. Oh, this is a lot of like. Red and blue, like seriously a lot. How am I supposed to handle this distribution? <laughs> I'm so bad. I don't think this is the. I don't think this was the right way. Not efficient at all. This. Oh, this might be too complicated. Like complicated as in, I know what I'm supposed to be doing, but whether the game gives me a good enough pieces for it doesn't mean it's viable. It's a full chain. If I wait for everyone to die, maybe my power will increase. Oh, I'm missing a green! Oh, the Shiro get another seven. Darn. Amazing. It's B chaining. <laughs> too good. You're too strong, Shiro. $50 of Puyo themed gummies. I would buy gummies, but for some reason they're just super hard to import. Not sure how Sega America got the gummies for their um, social media tweets. So I'm going to remake the room and see if anyone else wants to join. Oh, that was you, Rosie? Yeah, thanks for playing. Hmm? Well, I mean, yeah, they probably have contacts in Japan who will, like, send it over. But, like, if I try to buy from Amazon Japan or something, I just get errors where it says, like, it's not going to accept it on my address. Oh, you're Jay Quick. What happened to the audio? I think the audio should be working. Let's 
Tier shopper, what's that? Mm, I don't know. It's a lot of money to drop on just getting like gummies. It's like super hot. Let me like mess with the thermostat. Okay. Let's get to work. Let's get to work. Oh yeah. Does DM DM me on Discord advice? Like, I'm not sure if I want to like drop the money on it now, but eventually I might want to look into getting some like real merc or something. Uh, this one is so good. funny. Chain. I don't like it. I think I'll need to start practicing Yao Yui again next week. I still haven't gotten it down, I feel. And I haven't learned how to apply it in a real fight yet either. I kind of thought about streaming for another hour, but I'm already getting like super tired. It was a pretty long day at work today. I think I might just do like, uh, I don't know, one more set or two more sets, and then I'll just call it a night. So if anyone wants to join, let's just go, okay?
Oh, okay, see you later. Hmm, and no one else joining? I'll give him like give you like two minutes if you want to join in. A proper lady drains hard. Oh hey guys. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I love Zed's Did You Sleep Well? Because it hits home so hard. <laughs> uh, you know, I just graduated from college and like, I don't know, I haven't recovered from the four years of sleep deprivation yet, so... I've had a lot of recovery time that I'm not... that I need to get, but I'm not because I care too much about Puyo. <laughs> Oops. Oh, did someone leave? We left. Uh, I'll wait like two more minutes and then I'm just gonna start. Uh, yeah, thanks, Shiro. I'm glad. Glad college is over. <laughs> Dorian. Hey, from Japan? Hello! I guess he came to see us terrible American Puyo players? <laughs> Make it correctly this time. Tune in for the next episode of Dragon Ball. my chain there but like I don't really have any other moves fine Can I build any form regardless of color RNG? Well, I wouldn't say you can build any form. It's more like you could try forcing the form, but whether it comes out efficiently or not is a totally different story. Uh -huh. 
I wouldn't say it's a good idea to always go for the same form. Like some forms are suited better to certain distributions of the Puyo. So that's just something you have to keep in mind. Whether you think it's an acceptable risk to make a form over one form over another. It makes sense it makes more sense than like an abstract level, I think. You need experience making Puyo chains to know like like you could make GTR with these pieces, but like maybe long GTR is more safer. Depending on like maybe your opponent has a rush setup built. There's considerations like that that you have to think of. Why did I do it so stupidly? Ah, help me. Okay, I fixed the tail, I guess. It's not so ugly anymore. These tailing forms. I'm not a tailing specialist. Like maybe Shiro is. Got a lot to work on, huh? Yes, this is okay. Hmm, it powers nicely, I guess. What is something more amazing? Okay, one more set, guys, okay? Efuramu, you enjoy watching me play. Thanks, that means a lot to me. I mean, to know that people enjoy watching me play, like, watching anyone play Puyo in the first place. <laughs> watching Puyo at all. That makes me happy. Super happy.
I don't know. I don't want those purples to look like that. I want to fix them somehow. How about this? Follow. Thank you, Goofy. And Lunar Magic. I think I missed you a couple minutes ago. As the seven chain, the minimum. No, for these sets, I set the chain requirement to eight. If you want to flood the entire board in like a real match, I guess you just need like a five chain or a power four. How <laughs> over here on the left, tail wasn't so good. I can make it man make it work though. Uh oh. No. It's gonna take a lot of effort to fix. Ah, no! Hey, wait. Without me, at least do you even make an A chain <laughs> anytime soon? Uh, I kind of want to go to sleep. <laughs> go, 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 go. Uh, their chains are like really messy, huh? Learned it by watching Tom and Momo Ken. Yeah, maybe I should actually watch them. I think I'll try image trading their chains afterwards. How's that? I'm kind of just winging it right now. I don't really understand the logic behind it. Watch the the top players play. You just take notes on their build orders. Like if you have this distribution, 
Then you build it this way. Like if they get, you know, like three of this color in combination with like two of another color, you think then you should probably go and like place the pieces in this order as opposed to like brute forcing it in a different direction. I'll probably need to change some it, but hope that made it some sort sort of sense. Oh, uh, did he die on purpose? those yellows on the left. I don't want that to power and, and cut instead of actually chain. I think Hiku does have Puyo Puyo Tetris for the Switch. Wow, it's just like the chain sim. I did it correctly. not working. I'm so bad at managing my colors. Better. I'm tired. I'm gonna quit. <laughs> 
Oh no, my tail cuts! Okay, thanks for playing with me, guys. It was fun practicing together. So, I know that friend codes are pretty useless without uh, the smartphone app that T Nintendo still hasn't released yet. But if you want my friend code, uh, here it is. We can all be friends! Yeah! <laughs> Anyways, yeah, thanks for coming out to watch. Uh, Vice Arcadia, if you're still watching, thank you so much for the donation. That makes... Actually, what is my... So, my ultimate plan is to... I wish I can go to EVO in July. But I basically only have one month left to grind up enough money to buy, like, the plane ticket. So I don't know... I'm going to make it or not. I still have a long way to go. Like, I don't know. I think I still need to grind up like 500 or 600 more in like dollars. Well, probably more than that. I'm counting on some donation money too, but like, <laughs> I know that not everyone has something to contribute. I don't know. I'm, the, I'm just really desperate. I need to get to Evo somehow because. If they don't go there for their Puyo Tetris tournament, like people won't know what high level Puyo looks like. Because there aren't really that many high level Puyo players in the United States right now. So yeah, I'm really praying that I can get up get enough money to go. So if you guys know anyone who wants to support me, please, I'm begging. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't a shameless dishonorable begging or anything. <laughs> If you get another nice commission tip, I'll get it. Oh, thank you. Maybe? I don't know. I feel bad getting... I don't know. Part of me has like some weird sense of pride where I kind of want to get the money myself. But I also value teamwork, right? Maybe? Whatever. I want to get to EVO at all costs. Because I have a very strong feeling that 90% of the people who signed up for the tournament there are just going to be Tetris players. And no one's going to really know that... Over 50% of the game is actually Puyo Puyo. <laughs> Maurice, yo, hey. So wait, didn't I like fight you? You're the guy like I fought you and then like your your wife, right? That was pretty funny. Yo, I love your stream. <laughs> I'll come back to it too whenever I'm like, I don't know. I've just got, a lot, got lots of training to do. Do you guys see how long I've been playing Puyo Tetris on my Switch? Over, like, what? That's what, 170 hours? <laughs> Still gotta play more. Alright, so yeah, I think that's it. I wonder if there's anyone I should like host. Is anyone else streaming? Who is streaming? Oh, Sega Addicts. They're playing Puyo Puyo Tetris. What? Hey, I think maybe I'll host them. Maybe? I remember playing Sega Addicts a while ago. Um. Yeah, I think they, sh they bought the Japanese version of Puyo Tetris like, I think like last year. And they're like, hey, we need people to play. So I was like, okay, Puyo Nexus, let's go. And then we like totally crushed them. And I think they felt bad. <laughs> Whoops. But you know what? Fun does not come without a price. Your soul getting torn to bits and then stored back together because you have to play Puyo or else you can't breathe or drink water or eat without it. That didn't really make any sense. I'm sorry. <laughs>